hi guys welcome again to Eternity rebranded uh, today i'm going to show you a good video on james gishuru road that connects from here where we are this is a junction between james gishuru gitanga road and kingara road so james gishuru connecting all the way to westlands at abc so this is the james gishuru road from this particular junction if you go past the junction it now turns to Kingara Road going to Ngong Road. So this is James Gishuru Road. And guys, remember to subscribe, remember to share, remember to comment and like our videos here on James Gishuru Road. Uh, with me here, I'm also having Shifting News, which is also a great channel giving you great content. Guys, also remember to visit it, like the comments, comment there, share the videos of Shifting News. How are you for shifting news? Ah, thank you for... I'm very fine. Mm -hmm. Thank you for hosting us here. This is an amazing channel. Etala you rebranded. Rebranded. You are rebranding. I'm rebranding things. Ah. Yeah. Uh, how can you rebrand the Kenyan economy? It is time. I think that will, will be done <laughs> in time. Okay. Yeah. So guys, enjoy the views as Etala you rebranded brings you amazing coverages across Kenya it will be the, I think it's focusing on lifestyle and a lot of travel yeah so the kind of support is just subscribing you like the videos share them and you can always comment tell him where he can go cover or tell him tips of how he needs maybe to pick up on it and you can also remember to visit Shifting News, make sure you subscribe, comment there, like the videos. So we are in Lovington, on James Gishuru, and you can see the ambience here. It he tells you the kind of place that is here. Is that a Subaru? Those are Subaru boys, you can see how they are going. It's a, it's a weekend. And it's a weekend. So he's enjoying because this road during weekdays normally has heavy traffic. Does he feel at a different place? <laughs> <laughs> I hope you understand I, my question. I understand your question <laughs> because of the current uh, food uh, fuel prices. Yes. Maybe it's fueling in uh, the other side of town, along Thika Road. And I can see here amazing houses. houses. You can see the shades on the road, yeah. the trees, and the amazing trees, the greenery. Yeah. It reminds me of a song we used to sing while in primary. Ah. The jacaranda I grew beside along the streets. I don't know if you... You can sing. I think I... Uh, for me, maybe my primary way is school. <laughs> I think uh, either I forgot or, or we were not taught. You are not taught. You know There's sometimes... There's a song we used to sing in primary mm. about the jacaranda. I grow in towns and something and so forth. Ah. So I, I remember and then I'll sing it. I remember the lyrics very well and then I'll sing it to the guys. Ah, you can see the fuel there is 211. 211.60. That's about, uh, the dollar right now, that's about 1 point something dollars. Yeah, so 1 point 9. So this is the Lavington Mall. Ah. On my right. And you can see. It has a supermarket. They have a mall in it. Ah. It's a mall, it has a supermarket in it, it has a club, it has shops there. So you can visit. So you, you can see, you can even have there. areas where uh, you can take your kids to play. And you can also come for shop. Is it winter shopping or you just buy the heavy machines you are seeing packed here? Ah, and I can see there is an international school. As I was telling you, you know, when we were schooling, there was a time uh, if, if we failed, you know what you would tell the teacher? No. Do you want to know? Please let me know. <laughs> we would tell the teacher that they said what you didn't read. <laughs> so I read here you said here. Yes, I, yeah, I read yeah. here you said here. Yeah. You know sometimes people are not, they are not, they are not false. It's only that the teacher decides to say it. Where they have not studied. Yeah, where the pupils so, of students haven't read. Was it cramming or right, reading? Because if you say that, it means you are busy cramming. Okay, you know, let me not talk much, <laughs> you know. My teacher might be watching me. Yeah, and say, what are you doing? Though know, they did a very wonderful work. Mm -hmm. 
you know without that education i don't think if i i would be sitting here talking with you uh, with fluent english like this uh, is it fluent yeah, yeah you know some uh, i i was anticipating to talk like a native mm -hmm. you know i don't so what do they mean by native and uh, fluent uh i think fluent is a you are not uh, in english not your mother tongue mm. and then you can speak it well. ah so and then a native now it is like so we are natives of because i don't think we do we don't take english as an international language we take it as what mother because language. no chemistry everything apart from swahili they are taught in english they are taught in english when, you know someone was telling me there is one language that I miss to learn but uh, I don't know if you know it which one is it one one that is very famous in Kenya we shall find out <laughs> this is Muzima Springs Muzima Springs you can use it to go to Riverside ah yeah Riverside is the one connecting to that uh, that garden what is it called um, Aboreta. So yeah, 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 you can use this one and then you can connect to Aboreta and there, are, the there are a lot of BMWs on this road. Uh, this is an area where I... Can we say people oh. are enjoying life? Like, like that one? Guys? With this skill. So the German machines are many on this road. <laughs> I can see the Mercedes. Mercedes is there. And the super bikes. And it seems you... You know, in the other video, you told me about Kawangware. Now you are telling me about uh, Lovington. So, where do you live? You know, I'm beginning to yeah. suspect that you are a resident of Lovington. This is Mudangari police station. So, I, I reside in Nairobi. So, if you are in Nairobi, you must have known all the routes in Nairobi. Ah. For you to survive. Especially if you are driving in Nairobi, yeah. you must know how to maneuver the traffic. Okay. If I get traffic on this road, I know if I can use this one to go back to Kawangwar. So you see, you have to know how to maneuver to it. Ah. So you can come and buy flowers. You have, have you bought one for yourself? When I get an apartment very soon. Oh, you are planning? Get an apartment. Good you way. know, when you continue planning, there is what you call price hikes. Uh, maybe right now it's one million. By the time you are resolving to do it, three million. So, so I, what do you mean? I should go with the you, amount I have right you, now. Yes, you need to plan and implement immediately. In this economic times. The you know, I remember a few like now it's 211 Kenya shillings. There is a time it was 80 shillings. <laughs> and you are still like ah, very expensive so I don't know is it inflation or oh, the money has lost value I think I'll get an economist and do a video about it ah. uh, to tell us what is happening okay. uh, with the current stage we are in so we have moved from now this is ABC area of Westlands Ah. We are moving from we are now in Westlands. Mm. And this is the road that connects to the highway. Okay. So James Gishuru ends here at the roundabout here. And then from here you get the highway. Very and amazing road. Amazing, very amazing road. And the highway you see above here it is the Nairobi Expressway. Nairobi Expressway really? No. The the one on this, on top. this is not an the express. flyover. This is just a uh, flyover to just to. It Asian is part of the expressway. Okay. Yes, it was built by the sea. But the main aim here was just to ease the congestion here at the roundabout here. Yeah, and you can use this one for free. For free. This was the now this is the only part expressway is free. Yes. Okay. Yeah. I'm, I'm good to know that. So it is on this one. So if you go on the right, you are heading to Nakuru. You go on the left. If you go on the left, you are heading to Nakuru. You go on the right, you are heading to city center. So, guys, thank you 
and in our next video i will show you how you can get into wastelands from this particular point james gishuru roundabout thank you remember to subscribe share and comment to my videos